Hey guys, Randy Richard here uh, in the shop. So, um, Harbor Freight was having a uh, sale here this morning. Or I got a flyer, I should say, in, the, in their little newspaper yesterday. And I've been wanting a hydraulic press for a long, long time. Well, 20 ton one on sale with a coupon, 159 bucks. I can't buy the materials for it, for that. So, I uh, ran down and got one. We'll get her opened up and put it together. I had to do, I did this because of the uh, motor shaft, right? So, Get that uh, pressed apart. I also bought some uh, good NSK bearings for it. Uh, get rid of the chainings ones that are in it. You got the thing apart, put new bearings in it. It's well worth it. So, there's the jack. Hopefully, this works. Works. It's got the screw uh, center part like that. That should uh, that must go in this end. Anyway, there is the jack. Springs, bolts, pins, the table, table part. Basically, all the reviews, I read all the reviews on these things. They said buy the gray one, not the orange one. The gray one weighs about 20 pounds more, so there must be something about that. The steel must be a little bit thicker or something. It's a little bit wider. Uh, the, width, the, the, the dimensions are about an inch each way bigger. But everybody said get the gray one. Better, better. So, they got some gray ones in yesterday, or this morning I should say actually. This morning their shipment came in and uh, There's the blocks. I have uh, some nice heavy plate, um, actually from uh, graders, you know, road graders. The cutting edges on those things are about a foot wide, inch plus thick plate. They're really nice. They're, you got to kind of manipulate them a little bit to make them what you do want to do, but they'll make great plates for this thing. Yeah, I've had those grater blades for a long time. I use several of them on my disc for weight. Instructions. The hell with instructions. I'm an engineer. You throw these away for a stop usually. <laughs> but there's a picture. There we go. All the instructions you need. Picture. Not too much assembly, it looks like. go. Not too much. Put the feet on, put the table on, put the jack on. You got to press. Looks pretty well made. Welds don't look too bad. 
Those are rough edges right over here. I'll take a they hit a grain or something. That's pretty rough. So there it is. We'll uh, get it together and I'll show you what I got standing in the shop. There's the rest of it. Okay, it's all together. Ready to roll. 20 tons. Lots of warnings. Gosh, I need those warnings. So there we go. I think it's gonna it's gonna live right right here. Holy Right about there, so, so I can get back here to the grinder and the wire wheel and stuff. That's going to be a good spot for it. Once I settle on the spot, I'll probably throw a couple lag bolts at least in the floor uh, so it won't move around too much. But we'll see. So I'm impressed. It, like I said, it does look fairly well made. A little rough edges right here. I'm going to have to. So I take off, it's pretty rough. And then I'll uh, you know, give a little paint there. So, ready to go.